Hello and welcome back to Nikki Talks Trailers. I'm Nikki Limo and we have some trailers to talk. Today we have Despicable Me 3, Dunkirk, and Spider-Man Homecoming. Let's talk some trailers. So by now you probably know the links to the full trailers are in the description if you want to check them out. I highly recommend it so you know what we're talking about. Let's get started. First up we got Despicable Me 3. This is the third movie in the series, so by now we can all expect to see a year of Minions and McDonald's commercials. Yes! I'm pumped. So a heist being performed to the tune of Michael Jackson's Bad is almost as scary as the video where MJ dance fights an entire gang for like 13 minutes. There's also a part of the trailer where Gru pulls out a water gun and shoots his enemy four times in the face which is pretty jarring when you consider he expected that to be a real gun. Yikes. Could have been a way different movie. Next up we got Dunkirk. This movie is based on a true story, so if you want spoilers, you had 76 years to Google them. I feel like there are so many war movies now that the military industrial complex doesn't even need actual war anymore. Dunkirk is clearly the title they settled on. The original script title was Pew Pew Bang Bang Kerplow! which I still think is pretty good. It's a good thing that this true story happened in the French city of Dunkirk and not the French city's Brest or Perpignan. Two tough sells as movie titles. And lastly, we got our trailer of the week, Spider-Man Homecoming. Everybody is saying that this Spider-Man is gonna be way different than the other Spider-Man movies and we can tell cause this Spider-Man's got webs under his armpits and not like all over his body. So already way different. There's a lot of CG in this movie. I wonder if the inventor of CG knew that his great invention would only be used for superhero movies. Michael Keaton is back as Birdman in this movie, looks like, which only proves Hollywood's infinite wisdom and originality. Robert Downey Jr. shows up for a few scenes in the trailer where he says some snarky things and then moves along, so I think we pretty much saw all of Robert Downey Jr. scenes. I wonder what took longer, Spider-Man inventing his new webbing for this movie or Tony Stark inventing an entire new element in four minutes in Iron Man 2. All jokes aside, I think this movie looks pretty fun and I'm super pumped for it. Which brings us to our next segment, Capture This. I asked you to caption this screenshot from Spider-Man Homecoming on Twitter, at Nikki Limo, and here's what you said. Quick, give me that roll of piece of paper. There's a spider on the ceiling. No, you're on the ceiling, Aunt May. Where on earth did I put my car keys? So frustrating. Turn off the light, Aunt May. I'm hiding. Hide and seek. Extreme edition. Spider pig, spider pig does whatever a spider pig does. Anyway, that's all the trailers we have for this week. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on next week's trailers. And also follow me on Twitter, at Nikki Limo. I ask you to caption things all the time. Also, if you wanna just talk to me, I'm lonely. And that's it. We're done, Kirk. I waited the whole episode to say that.